What's up, everyone? Hey, Chef Martin with you. Buongiorno. Buenos dias. Welcome, welcome to the nude life. I just finished doing a podcast. Uh, now I'm going live with y'all on YouTube. Um, more than welcome to hang around and listen. All right. <laughs> I'm just going to briefly cover my week and we'll go for there. It's been a hell of a week. Um, this is To The Nude Life. You can also hear me on anchor.fm slash To The Nude Life. Welcome to, to listen in anytime. All right. Uh, real quick, two things that happened this week. Grand opening of Popeyes we had here on post. And the other one's my pilot that I'm pushing out. Uh, it's a TV sitcom called to, uh, The Barely Normal Life. And I have all this paperwork in front of me. I've been uh, I've been getting ready to do this script, and I've been pushing it out on YouTube, uh, Facebook, Instagram, any chance I get. All right. So uh, just sit back. Let's see what we got today. All right. All right. Let's start with Popeyes. Here in Iraq, uh, we have one fast food place. It's a pizzeria. Okay. We had a Popeyes come in. Went this morning, grand opening. I got all dolled up. I even put clothes on, all right. <laughs> uh, got me a 12-piece. I was starving. That way I can save some for later. Got a large Coke, uh, some spicy fries, and uh, I think four biscuits. I, I left all that side shit alone. I went straight for the chicken. That's what I've been eating, all right second topic that i want to discuss i'm very proud of it's called the barely normal life and it's basically uh my brothers told me to get put pen to paper and and uh write down my life my life story well it comes to find out it's like a sitcom i'm having a blast i had a blast i got with miss uh colleen Boultry. she is my editor and everything i write Anything you need written, taken care of, grammar checked, I don't care what it is, she's the one to check it. She is damn good. If she can fix my chicken scratch, she can do miracles, all right? I keep checking because I keep getting emails coming in, messages popping in. So, put pen to paper, uh, did my life, and it's got just a, when you do this, it, they're done by episodes. Okay, so the first episode, they want a script attached to it. So my first episode, it's called The Departure, and it's basically um, a nudist man lives his, leaves his job of overseas government contracting to reintegrate into his colorful family while finally being able to fully embrace his life of nudism and tiny house living. And as y'all know, I'm a nudist, and I do live in the little fifth wheel, 27-foot prowler. Love that house. Love it. So, basically, it stems on that. Of what's going to happen when I leave the game and go back home, okay? And um, here's, here's an example of what is this. This is uh, Act 4, uh, page 14, and it's basically me, Martin. And I've met my good friend, Kristen. I've met her at the Frankfurt Airport. And uh, she's met me, she's met me to, to, for a meal. And we're going to sit down. We're going to eat a meal at this German restaurant. And I've asked her to, because, to be a critic, a food critic with me, okay? So basically, it starts like uh, my podcast usually do. Uh, welcome, everyone. This is Chef Martin coming to you live from Frankfurt, Germany Airport have the privilege and honor of running into an old food blogger and on and on. And then it goes into Martin and Christine, we're laughing. Uh, Christine says in her Australian accent, uh, hola Chef Martin. And then she gives me an air kiss, air kiss. Uh, I'm always happy to assist you, okay? So these are basically the scripts of the script to the first to the first episode i've had a blast uh another example uh, you know coming through here it's the last one it's on page 19 and it's where i'm getting ready to board the airplane and it's where uh, 
The gate agent, she announces, gate Echo 26, E26, is now open. Have your passports in, in hand and be checked. And I go through the passport counter line and then uh, get load the bus, okay? And then Martin walks up the 45 steps to enter the plane. He finds a seat, takes out his earphones and sits down. He adjusts the TV and finds the music channel. He inserts the earphones closes his eyes and remembers when his kids were young. He is going home. He is going home to start his new life. The barely normal life. Okay? So if you get a chance, go to chefplaya.com chefsplaya.com and you'll be able to read all the most of the map. You'll see the script is on there. The synopsis of everything. Okay? When I did this, I posted, I posted, um, on TV, TV writers vault. And that's basically, you post your synopsis on there. And what happens is TV producers go in there and they check your stuff out. They're only checking the synopsis. They have to get a hold of you so you can show them the script and then y'all talk numbers and if they're interested, things like that, okay? So that's where I've at. And uh, I've had a, I've had a Buck Productions come back twice now. This is the second time they've come back and looked at my stuff. I'm taking that as a, as a, as a good sign. Now, Buck Productions is not a porn industry production. It's an actual <laughs> international TV production company, okay? And I'm, I'm happy as hell that they're interested. The other one is uh, Atlas Media Corporation. They're United States. They're states. Uh, some of their hits are uh, Hotel Impossible, Auction Agent, in the line of fire, uh, playing with fire. Now, apparently these dudes like fire a lot, okay? So that's the other one that's been looking at my project. And I'm, I'm happy as hell that at least, my goal when I started it was just to get someone to view it. And they have, that. so that goal's check, check, okay? Then my second goal was to get someone international. And that's the Buck Productions, so that's check. Okay. Basically, what I'm trying to tell you is, you know, if you have a dream, you have a goal, stick to it. Stick to it. Find a way. Research. Don't give up on it. All right. Don't not give up on it. It will happen. Okay. All right. That's basically it for today. I just wanted to come live to y'all. Keep it real simple. Keep it down and dirty. You know, as they say. And uh, just enjoy the day. <laughs> All right, this is Chef Martin. Y'all take care of each other, all right? Adios.